Hi everyone, um, it's a little dark in here, uh, but I did say I was going to show you girls, uh, or guys, uh, my daughter's hair, and this is her hair right here, there. see that, told you it's a little like curly, it just got washed, I'm about to uh, separate it into six pieces and um, show you guys what I kind of do to unknot her hair. Alrighty. So right now it's very tangled and I just washed it with Herbal Essence Curl Hydration. That seems to work uh, pretty good for her. It does kind of leave a dry, a little bit of a dryness. So right now I'm just going to separate her hair into six pieces. Yeah. Okay. So six pieces does not have to be even or done with the comb. I just kind of separate her hair uh, with my fingers. So Lilo, hold this for me, please. Yes, mommy. Right there. So now I'm just going to take one part out. I use the Garnier Whole Blends, the oil, the olive, legendary olive for her hair. I use the cocoa for me, but for her hair. So I just, just gonna saturate each little uh, part that I have separated. And you see how it's still like not moist so I use quite a bit in her hair um, when she doesn't detangle it often hmm. I don't leave it in for long I just do that completely around uh, all the rest of the hair that's separated and then I'll show you what I do after if you guys are wondering, this is how much I use on each piece uh, of her hair. Just because she has long hair and it's curly and I want to make sure it's very saturated. So I'm still on the second piece, but once I'm done, I'll continue the video and show you guys what I do next. Okay. <laughs> so after I put conditioner in it, you can see that her hair separates pretty easily with the conditioner. I just grab wide tooth comb this one has three different styles on it i start with the widest part and just comb from the top just to bring uh whatever knots she might have down okay now i'm not gonna comb all these knots out i'm just doing this to the top because what i like to do with her is kind of just separate the hair and try to separate the curls little by little because sometimes the curls are just tangled so that's what I'm gonna probably do uh, well that's what I'm gonna do to all her hair kind of just separate it um, the pieces that are already separated and just run my fingers through it so that her own hair will separate on its own but I'll have use it use the comb um, and you see so once I do her whole hair um, I'll show you guys kind of once I do half, just so you can see um, how it's coming out. And it's just, all you do is you take a piece out. Once you've brung the knots down uh, halfway with the wide tooth comb, and you just kind of run your fingers through it. And wherever you see a knot, you just kind of gently separate because each curl is its own person. And the sooner you remember that, the better off you'll be with your hair. So, that's what I'm going to do. So, still just kind of unknotting her hair. It's been like 10 minutes. I have not <laughs> recorded this whole time because it takes quite a bit to detangle her hair. So, just doing the same thing I showed you guys a minute ago. Just... Taking the piece out that needs to be detangled, grabbing a wide tooth comb, and just 
bringing the knots away from her scalp so that there's room for my fingers and then I just kind of separate her hair and ow I'm sorry just do this try to uh, separate her curls there we go that's really cute my sister yeah, it, well, it's not, you know, it's not. It does, and it looks cute when it's like untangled. Sorry. So, once I'm completely finished, I'm gonna wash her hair out, um, which I'm almost done. I'm gonna just show you guys. The front hair is always the easiest um, to unknot for whatever reason. I that guess baby because, hair is why. Yeah. Um, so I'm just separating. My hair is a mess. Let's keep it. Alright, it's completely unknotted now. So you can see. Completely, completely. Not it. I can just run my fingers to it. So now we're gonna go um, wash it out. Okay. So I already washed her hair out. Now we're just squeezing it with a regular towel. Nothing fancy. Um, and that's her how it is once it is rinsed. So now I'm going to just comb it over and kind of just run my fingers through it like I was doing in the beginning as you can see just running my fingers through it a little bit thank you and you see her curls are way different than mine mine's are more springy hers are like Brazilian waves and um, so now I'm just gonna see how it's nice and saturated it's nice I'm just gonna keep running my fingers through it to the pattern of her hair which her hair in the front goes this way and then it's like a little circle here and her curls are always all over the place. I'm just kind of running my fingers through the pattern of her head without messing it up. Uh, now what I'm going to do is let it dry and uh, or dry it in a minute um, after it air dries for a bit because I don't want to damage it.